Satishri, sincerely thank everyone present here for giving me an opportunity to speak before you all on Lal Bahadur Shastri and our very father of India. Well, first talking about Shastri Ji. He is one of the prominent leaders of the Indian Revolution. Besides this, he became the second Prime Minister of India. Right? Yes. And moreover, he gave the famous motto, Jai Jawan, Jai Kisan. Thereafter, he was also born on 2nd October. Now, you are thinking that why is that also? Which means two great leaders were born on that day. That is our very favorable Shastriji. And the next is Mohandas Kramchand Gandhi or Mahatma Gandhi. Now, after completing his, his education, Shastriji joined the Gandhiji's mission of freeing India. After that, he took part in every major and minor protest and movement for freedom. And he was once, uh, he faced even imprisonment for many years for his action against the Britishers. However, we know him as the man of peace. Now, after Jawaharlal Nehru died, the country again needed a strong soldier to carry the burden of Prime Minister post. So the cabinet decided Lavadu Shastri as the second Prime Minister of India. During his reign, he took many great and big steps related to the domestic, economic and foreign policies. Thereafter, uh, he was uh, very eligible for everything. And uh, uh, what's over, he died in 1966 and still remember him in our hearts because of his uh, policies and great actions. Okay, well, now moving onwards to Mahatma Gandhi. He has given the title of a father of India because he followed the policy of uh, non-violence throughout his life to fulfill his goals. He worked tirelessly to remove the system of untouchability, which was very prevalent back then. And uh, he was just very prevalent for, uh, he was very known for his uh, three big movement, that was the non-cooperation movement, Dandi March, and the Quit India movement. The, his principles and uh, every kind that is uh, non-violence and truth was followed by the whole country. And not only that, every people like followed his policies and his principles. And uh, yes, he was one of the, he was assassinated by the way, he was assassinated, it only killed his body, but still remember him in his hearts. Because people just think that his idea and his thoughts and his principles and his true belief was there. We still remember in our hearts. Okay, so well I hope so I've given the true impact of Lal Bahadur Shastri and our very favorable Mahatma Gandhi through this uh, few words in this limited time and everybody enjoyed it, I hope so. So yes, on the coming occasion of 2nd October, let's pay a heartfelt tribute to these two great personalities. Thank you. Jai Hind, Jai Bharat. Namaste.